Hi, I'm Landon and this is Lando 27 Tech. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and hit that like button. And let's try to get this video to 100 likes, that'd be awesome. All right, so I've done a couple of videos on the Google Wi-Fi system. If you haven't seen those already, take a look in the cards and you can check out those videos. And uh, I walked through the full setup and gave my review of the system, which I think is awesome. Uh, and in those videos, I mentioned how I went from a Netgear Nighthawk wireless router to the new Google Wi-Fi system. And in the process, there's one thing I had to give up, which was all the ethernet ports on the back of the Nighthawk router. So for some people that might not be a big, big issue, but if you do like hardwired devices, like I do, there's a few, you probably want to have those back. And the Google Wi-Fi has one ethernet connection on each access point. So you can connect one thing per access point, which is nice, but it's, it's pretty limiting. So, this is a solution for that. It's really basic. It's nothing special. All you need to do is get an unmanaged switch. And in my case, I bought a Netgear model. It's this model here, 300 series switch. It's an eight port gigabit ethernet unmanaged switch. The model number is GS308 V3. And unmanaged means there's no configuration. You basically plug and play and you're good to go. So in this video, I'll show you how I have it connected to my Google access point and you connect it to the main point that's coming in near your modem and that gives you seven connections from this example anyways and if you're wondering i bought this on amazon it was thirty dollars i bought it out of pocket i picked netgear because i like the nighthawk performance and uh, i just wanted to stick with the name that i know yeah we'll do a couple things in this video we'll go through the quick setup which is really really quick anybody can do it and then i'll do a couple speed tests i'll show the difference on my Mac Mini, got my Mac Mini sitting back there, which I was using the Google Wi-Fi for a long time, and I just recently hardwired it. So I'll show you the difference in speed with Wi-Fi versus a hardwired Ethernet connection. And it's significant. There's a, a huge jump in speed. So, so let's go ahead, check out my messy setup that I need to clean up, but we'll take a look and then we'll get into some tests. All right, let's take a look at my beautifully messy setup back here. It's something I need to clean up these wires here. But for now, it's all working and it's working well. So. All right, you can see here on the bottom of the, uh, this is the main access point in the basement. On the, the left, there's an ethernet connection going to the modem. And then coming out of it on the right is another ethernet connection going into the switch there on the far left. And there's three connections. Nope, I've got four connected and I've got three spares. So I've got three more things I can connect. Ah, just a quick clean up here and then a recap of what's in here. So I've got a my circle connection. I've got an Xbox One, I've got my Mac Mini, and I've got a uh, PC uh, upstairs so that's running upstairs to the top floor for my son's computer. And I believe that's it. Four devices. Yeah. Okay, that's gonna do it for this video. If you are interested in getting this switch, I have an Amazon affiliate link. You can check it out in the description below. Uh, if you're not familiar with Amazon affiliate, basically it's a link to my account. And when you buy something, I get a small percentage and it doesn't cost you anything more. And it just helps out the channel. So let me know what you thought about this and I'll turn this over to you to leave some comments. If you have any questions, anything about this setup, let me know and I'll get back to you. Again, I'm Landon, this is Lando 27 Tech. Thank you for checking out my channel. Don't forget to subscribe, 
and check out my other videos in the meantime, and we'll see you again in another video. Take care.